What's up YouTube, Jeff back again and today bring you guys another video on making life easier with your new Galaxy S22 Ultra. Now one thing that can be very tricky if you're moving from an iPhone, and as you guys know I'm a huge Android guy, I love to see people switching from iPhone to Android. One problem is WhatsApp messages can be tricky to transfer your chat history over. Today I'm going to show you guys a very simple way to do this, brought to you by the sponsor of today's video, which is Mobile Trans by Wondershare. This is going to require a laptop. I'm going to be using my MacBook Pro. Of course, you'll need your iPhone, which is going to be the source. You're going to have your WhatsApps on here. And of course, you'll need your Galaxy S22 Ultra to transfer. A couple of other things you're going to need just before we get started. Of course, you're going to need some cables. So right here, I have a Lightning to USB-C cable to connect my iPhone to my MacBook Pro. And then right here, I have a USB-C to USB-C cable to connect the Galaxy S22 Ultra, which will be the destination phone for my WhatsApp chats. Now, before we get started, I did install WhatsApp on here and just do kind of a fresh install. So I just got one kind of test chat so we can kind of see how this works. A couple of things you wanna do before you um, start the process is turn off, find my iPhone on your iPhone, which will be the source. Then there's a couple of other steps, which I'll show you guys when we actually do the installation. And then on your Android phone, which is gonna be your Galaxy S22 Ultra, you're gonna to need to go in and turn on developer options and turn on USB debugging, which I've showed you guys before. You go into the about phone menu, tap on that build number, and then down here you'll see developer options. And if you scroll down, you'll see USB debugging. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that's enabled before the process starts. So once you have the USB debugging enabled, you've got your iPhone, of course, turn off find my iPhone for this process. You can turn it back on as soon as you finish. I'm gonna go ahead and connect the both phones to my MacBook Pro. I'll show you guys a quick tour of the Mobile Trans uh, website, and then we'll go ahead and take a quick tour of the software, get the process started. All right, guys, so we're gonna go ahead and take a look at Mobile Trans and get started with the process. So this is the Mo One Mobile Trans website by Wondershare. As you guys can see, you've got a free download to test things out. It is a paid app and there's gonna be a discount code up here in the description and the pinned comment as well if you guys wanna check it out. I'm using the Mac version. You guys can see some of the features here. It's a full suite, phone transfer, contacts, photos, music, videos. We're gonna be doing WhatsApp transfer in particular today, but it's a full suite that has all kinds of great functionality. All the pricing here for Windows, and this of course the pricing for Mac, there's different prices for the different features. You can get the full features for $49.99, which is the best deal. Again, we're gonna focus on WhatsApp transfers today, but there will be a link in the description for the website, as well as a coupon code if you guys are interested in checking this out. It's a one-click, basically, transfer solution going from your iPhone to your S22 Ultra. If you're a huge WhatsApp user, then this is gonna be a great value. So I already downloaded the app, but you can download it right here from the download button. I have it open here on my desktop. And so we're going to go ahead and take a look at the process. So the first thing you need to do is once you open the app, you're gonna tap on the WhatsApp transfer button here, and then you're gonna to need to connect both devices. Now I'm gonna be connecting my iPhone as the source, and then the S22 Ultra will be the destination. So the first thing I'm gonna do here, I've got the iPhone right there. I'm going to connect that using the USB-C to lightning cable to my MacBook Pro, and then it's going to populate inside of the options. So you guys will see here, it pops up right there, iPhone 13 Pro. Then I'm also going to connect my Galaxy S22 Ultra to my MacBook Pro, and that will be the destination device. So once I have both of them connected, you'll see both phones show up right there. Now you may get a message on your Android phone saying something about allow access to your data. Just go ahead and tap allow. As long as you've enabled USB debugging, then you should be good to go. And you can also click the retry button if you have an issue with that, and then it'll connect no problem as you guys can see right there. So what I'm gonna do now, very simple, I'm gonna transfer by hitting the start button. It does take a second for it actually to find all your chats and back everything up. It'll say transfer all WhatsApp chat history from source to destination. The WhatsApp chat history on the destination device will be overwritten. So that's fine, I don't have anything on my S22 Ultra that I care about. I'll hit yes. It's going to check all of the data on my iPhone and then it'll start the backup process. There's a couple other things along the way I wanna show you guys just so you're aware of how to navigate them. So we're gonna go ahead and let this run and I'll come back once it's backed up the app data and it starts doing the transfer process. All right, so you guys can see here that we've completed all the steps. We're in the last step 
and it says ensure your Android phone is unlocked. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and unlock my Android device using my fingerprint, and then I'll go ahead and allow access to WhatsApp for my media, and then and click next, and then you can go ahead and agree and continue into WhatsApp. So once I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and then complete the settings, allowing it to access the storage space. And then what we'll do is click next. I've already done that. It'll say, welcome to WhatsApp now. And uh, then we have to follow the instructions here that are on the screen. So what we're gonna do is log into our WhatsApp account. I'm gonna go ahead, we've got the screen there, welcome to WhatsApp. I'm gonna go ahead and type in my WhatsApp phone number. All right, so I went ahead and verified the code from WhatsApp. I'll go ahead and hit continue, allow access to my contacts. I'll input my information here, Jeff Springer. It's tough to do it behind the camera, but there we go. It's gonna initialize my WhatsApp. I'm gonna go ahead then, once it's initialized fully, I'll tap next on the mobile trans application, and then we'll be able to get our chats transferred from the iPhone. So as you guys can see, 98% the install of the WhatsApp, and now it's transferring my chats from the iPhone. The data has been transferred, um, and the version can't be updated. So um, if you want to update to the new official version of WhatsApp, then you know that's, that's up to you. But you guys can see right here, it transferred from my test number, which I created for this video, my WhatsApp call, my test sim, and uh, there you go. And that's everything. So you can choose to update or not WhatsApp on your source device. Everything is completed. And that is how you transfer from your iPhone to your Galaxy S22 Ultra using mobile trans. Let's go ahead and wrap this up and give you guys a few more details if you want to grab the mobile trans application yourself. Okay guys, now you know how to transfer your WhatsApp chats with one click from your iPhone to your Galaxy S22 Ultra if you're switching. Brought to you by my friends over at Wondershare and Mobile Trans. Again, I am going to have the link below if you guys want to check this out. Again, it's available for Windows and Mac. There's also a mobile version, I believe, as well. I just find it easier to do it with the computer. So if you guys are switching from your iPhone to your Android device and you guys want to check out the Mobile Trans software, along with any discount codes, I'll drop the link in the description and the pinned comment. I appreciate you guys checking out the video. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification icon for future videos like this, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching.